Hi, my name is Arvel Lawson. I'm a DeKalb agronomist in central Alberta and really excited to talk to you about 7444BL, which is one of our newest canola hybrids in our lineup. 7444BL is an excellent broadacre hybrid that offers great yield potential across western Canada. It also shows really strong vigor in the spring, which is always nice to see, and we've been really impressed with the disease package that it offers as well. The final thing that I'd like to run through today with you is just talking about the shatter reduction that we've observed with this product. It's one of our best in the DeKalb lineup in terms of reducing shatter, allowing you some more flexibility at the end of harvest. So when it comes to 7444BL, you know, we're really seeing the work that our breeding team has done in terms of creating potting efficiency on the plants. So of course we want to have a minimum amount of stock that can stand up, hold up the yield, but we also want to see strong branching, lots of pods, potting efficiency, and nice big pods because that's what's going to contribute to nice seed, big seed yield in the fall. So when it comes to 7444BL, we have a very strong R rating to black leg, which is fantastic. It offers that multigenic black leg resistance that offers more durability out in the field. It basically means that you have multiple genes working to protect the plants, and that's going to allow that disease resistance mechanism to last longer in the field than if you were relying on one resistance gene, for example. Why that matters is when you're scanning these plants, this is a perfect time to be actually looking for black leg infection, is when you're scanning the plants, you're gonna be looking for lesions, ones that are quite deep, that basically are telling you this plant has been affected by the disease. What I'm liking here is the fact that we've got nice clean stems. When I'm looking nice close to the ground, I'm not seeing any lesions from black leg. And that means that these 7444 plants have basically been able to reach their full yield potential because they haven't been impacted by that disease. So another disease that we need to be aware of in Western Canada when it comes to canola is sclerotinia. And as an agronomy team, we really wanted to look at how our 7444BL does versus some of the, or the sclerotinia resistant products on the market right now. So what we learned through our evaluations is essentially 7444BL is equivalent in infection for sclerotinia to 45S52. So that really tells me that there's nothing being left on the table in terms of sclerotinia as a disease. We do think it's important to understand how a canola hybrid is going to react to disease pressure out in the field. But as an agronomy team, our best management practice is simply, you know, when it gets to that timing when sclerotinia is of concern, that bloom stage of canola, we want you to get out, scout for sclerotinia. If the environmental conditions are conducive to disease, then you may have to consider a fungicide application to protect the yield that's out in the field. So when you're thinking about straight cutting canola, you certainly need to consider the hybrid that you've chosen. So 7444BL of the DeKalb lineup is one of the best in terms of that shatter reduction, making it suitable for straight cutting. The other thing though to keep in mind is that you really need to take a look at what the crop is doing at the end of the season. So when it comes to straight cutting, you want nicely knitted canola plants, something that's tabling a little bit, holding together, because that's going to allow you to have the best success when it comes to straight cutting. So with 7444BL, we've talked about a few things with this hybrid. One being the fact that it's a broad acre hybrid with excellent yield potential. I'm also very excited to see how it's come out of the ground for the past couple of seasons. It's very consistent in terms of its vigor. It's got an excellent disease package that offers some uniqueness when it comes to black leg and sclerotinia. And then finally, it offers a nice fit in terms of the shatter reduction that it offers. Not only if you're you know, a person who swaths and combines your canola, or if you're a person who thinks you're gonna straight cut, this product in terms of that shatter reduction offers really good potential in terms of yield.